Walker Video Games Hearthstone. It's been a while, but it's finally time for the last act of Blackrock Mountain. The Hidden Laboratory. All right. I have been reborn in the fires of Blackrock. I cannot be. Oh, but I just killed you. Oh, there's four bosses too. Jeez. All right. My inner sanctum is guarded by the most powerful defense system imaginable. Free to play warrior. Hopefully we can just bang through this. Kerash versus Omnutron defense system. Intruders detected. Victory or death. Fairly good hand. See, the good thing about Toxitron actually is we'll instantly be able to use that. Primary defense matrix. Might have Initiate. enough just like face damage. Our Canotron unit activated. Sequence complete. Hmm. Let's see. Our up portals online. See, I'm not sure if I'm just getting bad hands, because usually this deck just outranks people and like... Or maybe it's because this deck's super low scaling. It's like, these are all 2 and 3 drops, so maybe I'm just getting wrecked that way. He's already got a lot better board state than I do. Hmm. Hmm, this deck would be fairly good with Patron combo, like, I mean, like, playing this guy against Patron. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see. The problem is this deck has no one-drops. Because, you know, getting one-drops is pretty low risk. Okay. We're gonna keep you, keep you, because that means we got like at least something to do for two turns. Primary defense matrix initiate. So let's see, I, he's just coins. Like the coins were a two drop, like turn one that Our sets us behind. Hmm. Nice. We got um whirlwind. That's gonna be great as a board clear. See what we can't do? Yeah, so he's got three cards down. I think this will work. We go here, hit, hit, and then we just clear his board. So he can't return damage on us. And then next turn we'll have a Gnomish Engineer coming down. See that's actually not that bad because these guys are so annoying you kind of want to like actually take them out. Job's done. 
Okay, so this is actually a really good hand. Like, we're... Is this guy... That must be a card from his hand, okay. See, it's not really that big of a deal since he'll be dead in two turns. Let's see, I got... What'll do more damage? I think Axlinger will, in the long run, because it, he can trade out with that guy. Yeah, because, like, the first proc goes off. I can kill one of his creatures. Hmm. So those two will die. So I hit into him. All other creatures, alright. Hmm. For eight damage. And I think this is the the correct place. The following hit into that. Do the two damage. Get into that. Get into that. There he goes, kills two of his own, we get some damage off, so we're 20 to 9. Oh, so he gets his 6 draw, which means our spells will cause 0. Oh my god. That's fantastic. Oh wow, I think he just screwed himself completely. Like, he pretty much gave us win. Oh my jeez. So, four, it took four times, but it finally won. Just had to get a good run of cards for an actual aggro strategy. So the, the, see, the thing is when you're playing aggro, sometimes you're like, oh, these, you lose a few in a row. But it's... Oh, shut up. It's not because you're losing. What are we... Oh crap! Pass. Whenever a, a minion is summoned, swap its attack and health. Oh man, that means we're gonna have a lot of really tanky guys. Oh, that's really cool. Anyway, I was saying, dang, it'd be hilarious putting. Oh man, we'd have to almost want to put. Storm, storm wind knights back in her decks because they're two five chargers, which means we'd get five two chargers on turn four. Like that card's horrible. That card's now horrible. All our bad cards are good, and all our good cards are bad. So we're definitely dead. So we need to go change this deck. Let's see. Basics. We're gonna have to put Cleave in this deck, aren't we? Yes, we are. Some commanders are out. Let's see, Elven Archers for sure. Magma Rangers? Nah. For four drops, we're gonna want. Lords of the Arenas are gonna be so much better than her. Ooh, actually, Iron Forge Rifleman would be fantastic as well. Let's see what we got from Black Rock Mountain since we are allowed using those. Got two left. And patrons wouldn't be too hot. Let's see. Let's try this stick. So we got executes. Let's see what's our win condition here. We got charge. So it's pretty much these same win conditions as before. Just hopefully with better. Results, I'll say. Garrosh versus Maloriac. There can be no disruptions. 
Victory or death! Fantastic, good hand. Please stop with this fucking bullshit. Thank God we got him. The Lord of the Arenas might be saving us this time. Oh yes, that's so good. That is so good. That was so good, oh man. Oh, that's so bad. That's so good, okay. This deck might be working, cause like, that's what it's supposed to do. That's good. Glad we got that. We can do some fun stuff with that. Actually, we don't have a weapon. I'm gonna save it. We might need it to like clear some BS off the field. That's so good. Oh man. Yeah, get pulled. We don't have a weapon. Oh man. Kill. Armor up. We just literally did that so we could get tempo. Like the thing is, this different like between this game, like the only way you can get like tempo back is if with um a sludge belcher, which I don't think he's gonna have. I think we've done it. I'm pretty sure it's gonna blow it. Yeah, I got full mana. Yeah, there blew the trap. Farewell. Let's get him off the board. Still have tempo. For Blackwing. We're gonna do it. Oh man, we're gonna do this game. Oh man, I've been so pissed how long this taken. Turn us into one five. That's awesome. Not really. Oh man. We got win. Finally, it took like five games of free to play. But if you can BM the guy with uh, Elven Archer, it's worth. Oh man. Took a pretty much an entire deck change, but oh. That feels good. To commemorate this moment, Atromedes may not be able to see you, but he can hear you. Equip a weapon that grows as your point plays cards. So, we're gonna try the regular. This guy literally looks like I need to put two oozes in my deck, and that's it. We're gonna try this one game. Probably isn't gonna work, and then I'm gonna have to put oozes in my deck. It's got good hand, kick that away, we'll see. So, this is supposed to like do, like, the thing is, like, I'm not sure how this is going to work. Death waits in the darkness. I am so confused. Like, I thought I was going to have to put stuff. And foul stench give you away. Um. Let's see how this works. So you play a useless minion. You play two useless minions. 
And then you play like what a third useless minion? You gave me like five gongs. Like, um I hear That's nice. Oh, also that screws up his mana pool. Ah, excellent. Put him, you down. I think I'm gonna beat this guy one turn. Like, I know that's like kind of cocky, but like, you just hit that. That's nice. You didn't kill me. I am so confused right now. Like, he just did, like, he just took 8 damage voluntarily. 8 damage voluntarily. And, like, I play 2 cards. Why couldn't you have been easy? Like, I just reverberation gong. So, like, it destroys his weapon. He can't even replay it because he's got to summon, like, a Drake. It's useless. This is a one to. I didn't have to do. Oh my. Compared to the last boss, last boss took me like an entire hour to. It took me an entire hour to beat him free to play. I just first attempted you, got a fairly good curve, and you just dumpstered you. Like secret OP. The blind dragon. You should be ashamed. Uh uh huh. That's nice. how tough this guy's gonna be I hope it's not as tough as the second boss though I kind of hoping I actually need to make a death change because if not it'll look really bad on his house and his part but when you I don't know like I'm hoping you have armor because my hands pretty disgusting like you don't oh, okay you oh crap that's not good Oh, that's really bad. At least I'll get to figure out what this does. Something tells me it doesn't do that much. I have to go, he has insane board control, the deal being shot, and then I have to go back. Is this even possible with our free-to-play deck? 